Hello YouTube, this is RG Noodley. I'm going to do a review on the Lego sorting head and a demonstration of how it works. Uh, the sorting heads come in a range of faces. I've got a tongue poking out here, standard face here, and there's a few other ones. Firstly, just see what it is. It's basically a big plastic head. It has the Lego logo on the top. And it comes in apart into several pieces. So you've got the top which makes a hole. We've got the top layer which locks. And if we turn it around this way, we've got one tray, two trays, and the base. So the trays only go back in one way. The smallest whole one goes in first. Then the next one actually don't fit the other way, so they're gonna only go in one way. Lid, handle to the back, okay. and that locks on, and then you've got your top. So, turn back around here so we've got something to look at. What I'm going to do now is put all of this container of Lego into here. This the best way to get the best results for the sorting itself is to do it by hand. in there. And sorting itself into layers. Obviously though that's going to take a very long time so a quicker way to do it obviously would be to take the top off and to tip it in. I'm trying not to throw too much Lego everywhere. The directions that, you, that it comes with suggest that you shake it gently as you go, so we'll do that, and we'll keep tipping. layer is quite full, obviously lots of big pieces. The second layer has smaller pieces. And then the bottom layer has the smallest pieces. So it's not an exact science, but it's pretty good. Does its job. Makes it easier to um, put away and I guess easier to find different pieces when you're actually wanting to make something. So it's pretty functional. Cute. And that's what it does. So there you have it. <laughs> 